hero? Okay, I'll pay, I'll pay! Let's go. Oh my god. I ain't messing around here. Eddie, soldier. Hello? Marty? Phil Cassidy sent me. Oh, uh, hi. Marty ain't home or nothing. Oh, oh, okay. Well, do you know when he's gonna be back? I don't know nothing. Excuse me. What do you want, boy? Nothing. Are you Marty? No. Now get gone, boy. Bitch! Bitch! Get your sorry ass out here! I thought I told you to clean this shit up! Marty, Mary Beth's been sick. Don't be using that baby as an excuse, Louise. Cause I'll hit her as well as you. Are you Louise? I'm a friend of Phil's. Friend of Phil's? Well, why don't you say so, boy? I'm Marty J. Williams. I was too busy watching you threaten your wife. Well. We was only playing around, boy. He didn't mean nothing by it. He only hits me when I deserve it. Oh, yeah? Well, Phil says you guys might have some work for me. I'm Vic Vance. Yeah, sure. I got a few things need taken care of right now, as a matter of fact. Drive me. And Louise, you better have this shit cleaned up before I get back. You got me? A business interest of mine is having trouble with some idiots I need putting straight. What business are you in? I look after people and they look after me. Sometimes I have to remind them of their obligations if they don't. But mostly I just mind my own business. You mind yours, pal. You're gonna ruin the city, bring down condo prices and infest it with communists. I don't know what you're talking about. My name's Pete Banbury. I've fished these waters for 20 years. All I do is I fish and try to raise my daughter right. Well, Pete, there's some good news. Gordon Moore had saved your daughter from turning to a life of ruining families and being a prostitute. Oh, really? But she wants to be a school teacher, not a hooker. What are you talking about? A teacher? Not anymore, she doesn't. Why not? She's dead. Oh, no, please, no. I can't handle it. Oh, First, my God, leg. No, this. Oh, you crying. <gasps> of course I'm crying. My only daughter's dead. What kind of a... Okay, we're here. Now get on in there and teach them idiots a lesson. You're not coming? Why would I employ a dog and then bark myself? Go sick them, pal. Don't make me do this. Oh, 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 come on, in, buddy. Me. You want to get killed, amigo? Please, I can't afford to pay any more protection. You don't pay? You don't stay. Fuck this place up. Who the hell is this hero? You want a bullet in you? Who's the chingo now, mamon? Pinche retardado. I'm trained to fight, my friend. That you parallel? You gonna be soft? You done real good, Vic. M Marty, 
She's with you? What are you doing letting scum in your store? My protection don't run to no daily visit. Are you hot for me, boy? Is that it? You want to see my pretty face here every day? What? I, I... No! For of my time, your protection rate just went up. Come on, Vic. These Cholo boys normally protect a store nearby. Now it's gonna need new protection. Let's go get it. ...are purely fictitious. Isn't it a shame you can't buy me? You're running a protection racket? And more besides soon enough. Come on, put the pedal to the metal, step on it. ...plans to build golf courses. It's progress, just like my hair. I love that show. Some of the values are a little old-fashioned, but it's good entertainment that shows the value of patriarchy in our society. And speaking of... Maurice Chavez, at one time my show was buried in overnights, but now I am a man on my own. Today, helping me to press the issue and separate the sweet juice of truth. This is it. Let's get in there and bring them into the fold. But I pay protection to the Cholo. I don't see them protecting you any. Vic, get to work. Marty, this ain't right. You want to get paid? Be a man. Or are you all hat and no cattle? Please! I don't want any trouble! That's why you need us! Please! This is crazy! Fuck them up! You gonna be a hero? <gasps> Oh. Ah. Okay, I'll pay, I'll pay! Let's both think for a second. You done a man's job today. I might have more work for you. See you around.